morning. This is Dr. Mark Dupéry at the Visage Clinic here in Toronto, Canada. I'm doing today one of my signature plastic surgery procedure called repair of the pectus excavatum defect. So this male is a tall guy, very athletic, who was born with a divot in the lower chest. Now in this situation, it's not the classic <clears throat> mid chest indentation excavatum means excavation means divid or depression his defect is in the lower part of the chest including the lower ribs you can see that he's got a divid here and compensated and this is very common very prominent lowest ribs so number 12 and 11 are very very prominent and he's got a divid here and a normal upper chest so i've created for him a custom made patient specific implant. We did this about six weeks ago. We made a moulage according to the defect. And then they created for me this beautiful implant made of silicone solid, but very, very flexible. And this is the shape we came up with to replenish the volume, to give him back the contour that he wanted. So if the camera could come on the side. Now this is not the easiest implant to put in. So we'll go slowly and gently. The pocket has been formed. It's been made under the fascia. And then I will gently lay it down. Thank you, Jay. Voila. This is a beautiful result. This is something that will give this male back confidence. He'll be able to now go back to the beach, go to the pool, go to the gym and change with no fear of people judging him or looking at his defect in his chest. This is a procedure <clears throat> I have been performing here in Toronto for 17 years. So I started in my first year of practice back in 2001. This implant is made for him, so they make only one. It requires two visits as a minimum to my clinic. So one visit first for the moulage and one procedure visit for today. When the defect is small, it could be done under IV sedation, like a deep sedation with my anesthesiologist and local anesthetic. But I tend to see larger defect nowadays, so we put patient asleep. It takes about an hour, an hour and a half to do. Uh, it is important to drain this, so I have a little drain that comes through his belly button today just to remove all the fluid around the implant. The pocket again is under fascia, so I went under all the fascia, the rectus abdominis, the pectoral muscle, and the serratus muscle fascia. So it secured the implant in place, and it also gives an extra layer to cover the edges so that we don't see any edges of the implant. So thank you for watching. This is Pectus Excavatum Repair Correction with a patient-specific custom-made implant here in Toronto, Canada at the Visage Clinic. Thank you for watching.